Hi mga Avengers, how was your Halloween weekend? Me and my friends, we had a very nice party. We dressed up as Netflix characters, ranging from animes to TV series to movies. Para mas masaya ang gathering, we had games. Meron mga games na parang we need to win it. Ready, set, go! Kung saan, the first two players who can build a pyramid of cups by blowing a balloon that will lift the cup up wins. Meron ding trivia game about Halloween. Robin, what was the name of Dracula's sidekick? But in this video, I will not share any game mechanics or game specifications. However, I'm going to share to you now paano ko ba ginagawa ang mga game presentations ko. Sobrang dali lang. All you need is Microsoft PowerPoint. <laughs> One of the classic Filipino games ay ang Pinoy Henyo. And last Halloween, me and my friends played this game using Halloween-related words. Yes. Yes. Now, let's use this Pinoy Henyo as a game that we want to build or customize. Now, pay attention as I'm going to share to you how am I doing or how am I making my game presentations in Microsoft PowerPoint. Here are the steps. Step number one, finding words to play. First thing you need to do ay mag-isip ng mga words na gusto mong ipahula sa mga players. Now, since the event was Halloween, I googled Halloween-related words. I found 16 easy to hard words and I just inserted these words in Microsoft PowerPoint using a text box. Step number two, hiding the words. Now, this is very tricky, but this is really, really important. Para by chance talaga yung word na uhulaan ng player. All you need to do is just insert a shape, use a color that you want, and add an exit animation to this shape. And then the animation will be triggered by the click of that shape. In this case, rectangle number two. Try the presentation to make sure that the shape will exit once you click it. And that's it. Now copy paste this shape with the exit animation, put a number to it, and cover all words. Number three, set a timer. Just download a timer. For example, I want the players to play the Pinoy Henny game for only two minutes and insert this timer to the PowerPoint presentation and this will automatically play when clicked. And that's it! 
That's how easy I do my games. Now for this Pinoy Henny game, I ask a pair to pick a number they want to play and then let one player to not face the screen and the other to face the screen and see the word and answer the yes or no questions. How am I off? Yes. <laughs> And that's it. Sobrang dali lang, di ba? Just maximize the power of the exit animation in Microsoft PowerPoint. I hope this video or this trick will be helpful for you in case you want to build or customize a game with your friends. Thank you for watching another edition of Bench Game In, and I'll see you on the next one.